Hey everyone! So we have a popcorn container with a scalloped edge and a 14 by 14 canvas. So I'm going to do a flip cup and we're going to let that paint come out of all those scallops and see what we get. So this is our gadget for today and I'm going to start filling this cup. So I'm going to spray it with the WD-40 uh, silicone spray first to make sure all the paint comes out and it's easier for me to clean these out. All right. I'm just going to put a little bit of black in the bottom if I have any in here. Okay. So I'm going to start um, with Rumbacher Prussian Blue with the iridescent mixed in. I want to use this up. So I can make some more. It's kind of like leftovers today. Let me put a little bit of white on top of that. And some Prussian Blue. A little bit more white. Some Lucas Permanent Violet. Craft Smart Seam Mist Pearl. Soho Phalo Green Blue. And some more white. And I think I'll do some more Prussian Blue. I'm going to have a black um, base around it, so don't need a ton of paint. And some more seamless pearl. I am trying to get a little bit on the sides. Okay. So that's it for my colors. I'm going to set this aside and I'm going to put a black base down. And we're going to get messy because I have to flip that cup. So if you watch me on Facebook, or check me out on Facebook, um, you'll see a post that I put up for um, Nate Cerami. Uh, we're trying to get him here from Arizona to do a three-day collab with me. And he started a GoFundMe page. I will put that link down in the description if you want to chip in a couple of bucks to get him here. Um, I started his campaign off. I donated $50 because I just would love to paint with him. And we bounce ideas off of each other just about every day. So I thought what better way to spend a three day collab with Nate than to have him right here and filming live videos and filming videos that we can um, upload. It would be fun. So if you're one of my viewers and you know Nate, donate a couple of bucks. We'll get him here and have some fun. And of course we'll do a live so we can all interact with you. I already told him I'll feed him. <laughs> so he doesn't have to worry about buying food while he's here and we have some art um, outlets here that I'd like to take him and show him and of course I'd probably take him to Jerry's and um, just have some fun with them and paint when I mentioned it to Alan he was like uh oh that sounds like trouble. <laughs> but I think Nate and I will make some beautiful pieces together. And maybe I might do a giveaway for everyone that donates to his trip. And Nate and I can create it while he's here. So 
so I think that would be cool. All right, George. I'm just popping some air bubbles before I put that down. I need to fill my other torches. I bought two new ones. Okay, so I'm going to pick this canvas up. I'm trying not to get my hands too dirty, though. And I'm going to flip that cup over on it. So it's going to be quick. Because it's going to start coming out. Okay. We'll just let it do its thing. We might have to um, lift it a little bit on the sides. It's not coming out very well, is it? We'll have to help it. The colors are pretty, though. Okay, let me just lift it up. Maybe if I push up on the canvas. Oh yeah, that works, but I have to do it this way. Of course, the back of this canvas is going to be yucky. I, couldn't, I can't poke a hole in it, that's for sure. Unless I drilled a hole in it. But it is coming out on this side. Just wanted to see what kind of effect we would get with that. Oh, I'm making a mess though, aren't I? Black paint is so much fun to work with. Okay. I don't know how much paint we have left in here. Quite a bit yet. So let me just go ahead and break that suction. That did help. I want to be able to um, do some tilting to get this to the edges. There it goes. I think that's it. Okay. I do want to use a skewer just a little bit though. So we don't have that gob in the middle. I'm just going to bring it in like this, just a little bit. There's a lot of paint in there. It's terrible. Every time I go shopping now, I'm looking at gadgets. Gadgets. I'm going to change my gloves real quick. Get this black paint off my arm. We'll let that set for a second and see if any more cells come up. Got some interesting things going on in there. It is in the 90s here today, so I definitely have my air vent on today. If you hear it in the background, that serves two purposes for me. It keeps the porage nice and cool. And it also vents me, because it's right behind me. That's pretty. Okay, let me do some tilting. Oh yeah, there's a ton of paint on there. So we're going to get rid of some of this. That's pretty right there, too. Gosh, I like that just like that. Let's so get just a little bit more of this. I'll widen it up. Bring it 
to this side just a little bit. Looks pretty cool. Look at, the, look at all the lacing and stuff going on in there. Like see my little caterpillar started. We have some beautiful cells up here. That's why I didn't want to dump that off. Um, I could bring this off here and get rid of a little bit of that. Because it kind of looks like it's just sitting there. Just like that. Because if I take it all off, it's just going to be a, a flip coat. Just move it just a little bit this way. So just think. Um, of all the things that you can pour on or out of. Um, it's fun to play. You look at things at a different view. So while you're here, go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already. And click that little bell next to the subscribe button and you'll get notified when we upload our next video. Click like and share and leave a comment. Join us on Facebook. You can ask me questions there and send me messages, send me pictures of your work. Um, if you need help, you can show me a picture and sometimes I can figure out what went wrong. Well, I should say most of the time. <laughs> Shop with me on Etsy. Um, I only have a few paintings on there right now. That's going to change. But I do have jewelry. And Christmas is coming, guys. we got to get our jewelry up there. And we have to get some tiles up there. So we're going to be working on that this next week. Um, also, if you've seen... Some of my paintings that I no longer have in my possession, um, I do have those prints available on Redbubble. And you can have them made into coffee cups or cell phone cases or pillows. So that's kind of neat to check that place out as well. And that link's below. We also have a fan mail post office box. It's P.O. Box 863, Youngsville, North Carolina, 27596. And our stone coat, art coat, resin code is there. Uh, you get $30 off an $80 purchase. Use the code CWA, all in caps, and you'll get $30 off at checkout. But make sure everything's in your cart before you use the code. So I'm really happy with this. It's really pretty. I love the colors. So that's it for that one, guys, and I've got quite a few more to do today, so I will see you all on the next one. Bye now.